I want to show you the diverse palette that we create. And that's part of what we do here at Harder Boys, is create architectural elements that help in the design and the detailing of a home. I could probably do that better. Well, around it started, five it started, it started to run. And the golden, golden hour is going to be a lot cooler. <laughs> well, the golden hour means that by that time I will be fully cooked and ready to be pulled out of the oven because I'll be a crisp golden brown. Thank you. 167. <laughs> I'll see you in a little bit. So, you know, I always talk about all the different product lines. This is one house where we have a freestanding trellis that's really cool and uh, something I want to share. Oh, damn. Are we filming? <laughs> it wouldn't be a Hardy Boys filming day if there wasn't some unexpected turbulence. Well, you know. You know what they say about weather reports? They're never right. Today forecast, 0% chance of rain. Cloudy, sunny skies all day. Within an hour of filming, raindrops are hitting the site. But you know what? I'm not gonna let that stop me from bringing value to my clients and talking to them about some of the things that we do to help you through the process of shopping. How do you paint PVC? It's really the same as anything else. You're using a standard acrylic paint. You can buy at any paint store, any brand. They all work, okay? But there are a couple of things that you need to know. Number one, no oil base. This is a petroleum-based product, so like when you try to put an oil-based paint on it, it just does not adhere, okay? Number two, no silicone. Silicone caulking will fail. The other thing that you have to know is no dark colors. And you're sitting here looking at me with this stuff in behind me and they're saying that's black. I get it. The reality is you have to use a heat reflective paint. Sherwin-Williams has a vinyl safe paint. Aqua Suretec has a heat reflective finish. We're not just one type of product, one type of color, one type of shape. We're not in a mold. We make this custom to each job, but it's not custom priced. Okay, and that's something that's so important because we want to make the part for the house, not the house to fit the part. And we make them in all different shapes and sizes. And throughout the day today, we're going around, we're filming different houses. I want to show you all the different styles and shapes and sizes and scales. And then you'll understand why does this guy say scale and size all the time. This is a cool shot. 